Hi, my name is Jags Platinums, and if you're seeing this, then that means that I got the Platinum for World War Z, but at what cost? While editing this video on my MacBook, which was at the time my main computer, it has now decided that this game was way too much for it to handle, and it imploded like a submarine. Too soon? Ugh. Well, your friendly YouTuber Jags had to order a whole new PC just to keep giving you guys the content and now with the big rig I got, hopefully the content just gets better and better. With that being said, if you like what you see, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe because it would really help me out on this journey. Alright, let's get straight to it. World War Z became free on PlayStation Plus Extra a few months back and I've always been interested in the game. The Platinum Trophy is said to be a 7 out of 10 for difficulty with 150 hours of gameplay. Me and the boys decided to take it head on running into our first mission on easy and popping a lurker in the mouth. Like, my life. Like I got sport kills, kill lurker midair. I got a trophy, fuck it. We're locked in now, Goonie. <laughs> We enter the train to make our way through New York, finishing our first level together and popping our second trophy. Um, Teamwork! Finish any level with the no. whole team. I haven't tried one ball. We get stuck at a train station that we have to move the train through, but it's infested with zombies, and right before Goonie gets absolutely destroyed by a bull, I grabbed it by its horns. Got it! Torero? Kill bull during charge. Directly after, we started getting swarmed by a large group of zombies, and as I was firing at the crowd, I shot a gas puddle without even noticing. Oh, the floor is lava? Burn 10 zombies with one gasoline puddle? Somebody must have did it. Flying through the trophies, we also noticed that there are explosive barrels scattered throughout the map, and while my friends acted like bait, I blew shit up. Hold on. Wait for it. Wait for it. I'm trying to keep it here. Got it! Yeah. Explosive. Right. Kill 10 zombies with gas cylinder explosion. Easy, baby! Starting up our third level, I decided that since we are on the easiest difficulty, this is the best time to do the most effective way trophy. This is for using a pistol the entire level. This trophy was easy peasy because your co-op partners can just kill everything and you just follow behind cleaning up the rest of the bits. The most effective way. Finish any level using just pistol. I don't have to do that shit anymore. On to level 4 which is probably one of the worst levels to do this next trophy of not shooting your teammates for a full level. I guess I was the only one going for this trophy because Goonie thought it'd be a good idea to shoot a flare next to Al. Damn! <laughs> what was that? Who shot, who shot the flare? Who shot the flare? That's there. What are you doing? Hmm? What are you doing? <laughs> Nothing. Me? <laughs> After some scary encounters, we popped two trophies. Was oh, 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 oh! I hope I didn't just shoot. Oh. oh. Ah! Nice. Escape. Finish episode New York on any difficulty. I caution, finish any level without dealing friendly damage. I did it, Vicky! After being escorted by the military, we get dropped off in Jerusalem in hopes to extract a scientist who could help find a cure. In this level, my main objective was to not heal at all during the level. This trophy was easier than you cheating on your significant other because I was able to make it all the way through the level and at the end when I went down I just bled out while my friends finished the level. I, I didn't use a med kit. Nobody healed me. Nobody picked me up. Strong immunity. Finish any level without using healing packs. Easy nice. baby. With those trophies out of the way we run through the second and third chapter of the game with some crazy moments. Who used to grenade launchers uh, almost killed me. Uh, How fast 
this fuck, boy! Get him, oh, oh, holy oh. shit! Leave him, leave, leave him, kill him, 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 fuck him, fuck him. Should I let him kill him all? I'm not that way, I'm dying! I'm running with the zombies. Oh, oh I definitely just fucking killed you. Why cold? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> what the fuck just happened? When I went down, the door must have closed. That's the only thing I could think of. Hope finish episode Jerusalem on any difficulty, boys. While running through the chapters, we even popped a trophy for marking special zombies. Oh, effective communication. Mark special zombies 50 times. Let's go. I'm not <laughs> doing that anymore. Was, uh, look. Even while playing the game, we caught Mo off guard in something he said. <laughs> I will come for you, Mo. What? Hey, yo. <laughs> hey. He said it. Wait, I'll come minute. for you too, Al. <laughs> He's 15. <laughs> <laughs> That should be the trophy, I hope. That should be the trophy. <gasps> Boom, salvation of the motherland. Finish episode Moscow on any difficulty. Before we start the final chapter, I finally decided to level up one of the guns, which starts the huge grind of leveling all the guns to level 5, which we will touch on later. What is max? Level 5? Oh, yeah. there are many guns, but this gun is special. This one is special. It's mine. <laughs> Open and buy final version of any weapon. We board a cruise ship that was supposed to be full of survivors, but by the time we got there, the whole cruise ship got infected and we cleared the boat to finish the game. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see it. Come on. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Boom! This is just the beginning. Finish all episodes on any difficulty. With our first playthrough out of the way, we wanted to spice it up a bit, so we hopped on the multiplayer that is more dead than my social life to achieve the four trophies that are tied to it. Along the way, we noticed that we could get some equipment based trophies on the multiplayer mode as well. Oh, chain reaction. Hit 10 zombies with one stun gun shot. Well, that's something. The first multiplayer trophy that we all focused on was called Winner in Life. This is where you have to have the highest score in the lobby, and the boys held back while I tried to dominate the lobby, and we came out victorious. At least you got your trophy, Jags. Just... Yeah. Winner in Life. Finish PvP match with the highest score in any mode. Oh, fucking hell, man. We run up another game of domination because we had to capture one point and keep it the entire game without zombies or players getting to it. Mother carefully didn't try and kill her. There's four people down there, the whole team's there. I got one. Two. Three. One more down the bottom. Nice. I have to use Come my on. pistol. Alright, it's fine. No. It's fine. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. Game over. Boom. Yes. Yes. Owner. So... Capture the point and hold it until the end of the match in Swarm Domination mode. Next, we hop on Scavenger Raid, where we go around looting crates from kills or random locations until we hit the game limit of 400. The trophy we need is to carry 200 of those points at one time during the game. So let's see how we did them up so you get the trophy. Oh no no no! I'm shooting him, I'm shooting him, it's okay. You can oh, grab the fuck, I got it! Walk in bank! Gather 200 nice. resources okay. during single Trust match me. in scavenge mode. Now we have to grind out 25 matches for the veteran trophy, but along the way we prop the trophy for using our ammo box. Hey, people, anyway. Here's a box. Yeah. I should have it after this. I'll pick it up again. Uh, I still don't have it. Oh, dispenser. Dispense 10 explosive ammo packs to teammates. Then we got a trophy for using our masking grenade. Alright, 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 alright. 
Come on. And I got it. Yes, I, got I it. am safe. Use masking grenade on right. three teammates. What zombies near? Damn it. Now all we had to do was the 25 games. So we joined a lobby and eventually everyone quit mid-match. So a bug occurred where it still showed that people were in the lobby. So we were able to keep playing by ourselves and we just played the objective rushing the game to end and eventually we popped the trophy after two hours. All right. There's, no one, on There's no one on the team. Yeah, All I right. thought it was bugged. Get... Every Bucket. game we'll play now, we'll be no one on that team unless people join midway through. Can't wait to put this All shit right. on YouTube. Makes sense. Just keep grinding until you get to 30. Yeah. Oh, veteran. <laughs> Finish no. 25 PvP matches in any mode. God, that was a grind. What? Oh, finally. Now we start round two of our story mode run, but this time it's on the second hardest difficulty. Goonie did some research before we started, and the plan for this run is to use two mutators called Perfect Condition and I Feel Your Pain. Perfect Condition is where you can't die from going down, and I Feel Your Pain is where only one person can get hurt but they take all the damage that happens to any other player in the game. Of course, using these mutations, I was able to pop a trophy for being a team player. Hey, first aid! <laughs> Rescue 30 incapacitated teammates. Nice! This would be really good. We figured out very early on that we could use this mutation against the person it falls on to bully them. You know what's funny is I could shoot fucking Goonie and Al goes down. That's what I did earlier. <laughs> like, anytime Al talks shit, I would just fucking shoot Goonie. <laughs> oh, fuck you. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. <laughs> <laughs> I just fucking looked at him. While you run through the levels, you can usually find zombies that are lying down waiting for you to pass, but we pop some in the head to get a trophy. Come on. Yes! Can't fool me. Kill 20 lying zombies before they get up. Let's go. At this point, we could tell that we had spent a lot of time playing this game because we've met a milestone. Because there's like yeah. nine parts I have to grab. Genocide kill 10,000 zombies. Easy, baby. Easy. For the rest of the run, the game decided that I would have the mutations where I take all the damage. So I took it like a champ and we pushed through. Along the way, I got a bunch of the grindy trophies, as you will see. Got it. Waste of time. Defuse 10 mines. Let's go. Again? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, friend of a oh, friend of machines capture fifteen turrets. No, they're just like random friends we get. They can die. Can they die? Ah, builder, yeah, so. build a hundred defenses. Nice. Finally. See? Is your screen turning green? Like with the, the yeah, green stuff? proper green, yeah. Hopefully, I get a trophy. Come on, recharge, recharge. <laughs> Recharge. Please. Please. Okay. Yes. Burglar. Nice. Open 15 what rooms or containers with freaking charge. After seven hours of going down constantly, we finally got to the last level and we finished the game on the hardest difficulty. Um, Come on. Yes. Well, what did you achieve? Finish all episodes on insane or extreme difficulty. What the fuck? I also got one trophy. <laughs> one? Oh my god, that sucks. These last six trophies before the platinum would take me seven days to get because of how grindy they were. But I must say, playing the game with the guys made the experience a lot more enjoyable with some dumb moments like this one.
Who's teabagging right now? Huh? <laughs> Jax, are you the one teabagging? No, that's the AI. Oh fuck! <laughs> that's you! That's you! <laughs> oh, help! Help, 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 help! I'm infected! I'm infected! I'm infected! No, for real, for real, I'm infected! I'm about to die! <laughs> I'm, I'm swear I'm about to die! Hit him in the back! Hit him in the back! Oh, gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Give oh my! Is that gonna go in the video drags? No. But, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's gonna go in the video. Uh man. The first of the six trophies I got was probably the easiest, and that was for buying all the perks for one class, which we had to do for eight different classes, and I have just now finished my first one after playing the game for seven days already. Boom! Specialist. Open and buy all perks in one specialization. At least we got one tonight. At least one. After a long day of grinding, I got lost in all the chaos and I accidentally let some words slip out of my mouth. So, send them feet picks, guys. Send me feet. Send me feet. Send him feet or he'll do a dick dick stream. Yeah. No, no, the opposite. Send me dick or no dick dick stream. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> bro, what did you just say? I I just said bust what on my face. Nah, bro, that's still gay. No. You're gay! You're he's gay! I'm not gay. He's gay! Jax, I don't know if you heard what you said. What do you say? You said send me dick. Who said that? <laughs> you said that. I said that. Yeah. No, no, there's no. Did I say that? Yes. No, there's no. I was just thinking it and it came out. <laughs> it must have been on the top of my mind. <laughs> it's alright, Jax, we support you, man. Uh, send me dick or no dick dick stream. <laughs> yeah. No, no, the opposite. Send me dick or no dick. <laughs> Yes! What? Yes! There's no way! Sammy feet! There's no way! Did I say that? There may be a possibility that a few minutes later I accidentally slipped on my words again. Jags, are you the giver or receiver? Definitely receiver, no no doubt. Oh it that's is, even worse, Jags! But definitely the giver. And never receive. No, you said receiver. <laughs> no, did I say receiver? Yes, you did. There's no fucking way I said receiver. There's no fucking way. No, you're lying to me. Did I, did I say that? in 4K. Gay! I'm about to reload my own fucking stream. There's no fucking way I just said that. Told you, Jack, he's fine. You're in a comfortable place. <laughs> I fucking said That's receiver. Just out. I fucking said, said receiver. receiver. I'm gonna have to delist this fucking stream. There's no fucking. I'm just. I'm gonna have to delist this fucking stream. There's no way I can't let this get out. He meant he receives ladies to honor them and please them respectfully. Just saying, bro. I didn't understand what I was saying. I didn't understand the question. See, Marius, I didn't understand the question. I thought y'all meant like receiving women, not giving my women away. Come on, guys, get it, get it together. I will never, and I repeat, never get caught on live saying I'm a receiver like you. I meant like football, guys. Like a wide receiver. Like football. I was having some audio issues, but the grind continues, and I popped one of the dumbest requirements for a trophy. No. Ooh. Trophy. Trophy. Trophy, trophy, trophy. I <gasps> fucking trophy pops. Toxomaniac. Oh, I'm coming, I'm coming. No, one button. Oh. A few games later, I boosted a healing trophy with some AI. Oh. <laughs> I wish. Hey, what the doctor ordered? Heal 30 teammates with health lower than 20% with med kits or stim pistols. Eventually, my chat during stream started to ask us some weird would you rather questions. Uh, they said, would you rather jerk off a guy or be jerked off by a guy? Be jerked off by a guy? Yeah, I don't think I could jerk off a dude, man. 
Yeah. Well, I say not. It's yeah, it's bad, man. Either way, it's it's fucking brutal. Yeah, it's yeah, it's both is bad, man. I think I would be jerked. Uh because it doesn't say I enjoy it. It just happens. Just close your eyes and imagine a woman. A woman with a dick? What do you mean? <laughs> what do you what do you mean? <laughs> In the same night, I also noticed how dumb I really could be. Yeah. Jack's name third world countries. Oh. India. <laughs> uh Asia. Oh, India is not a country, son of a bitch. All right, Asia. Okay. Europe and Russia. Does that count? Is Russia a third world country? Are you fucking dumb? Let's talk about the weapon grind. You have to get over 20 weapons to level five and the only way to find them is to randomly come across them in levels. So I replayed the same level over and over again using a horde strategy that kept the zombies coming so that I could level up the weapons and eventually I would finally be able to finish the weapon grind. Now, as you can see, this is my stream footage because one of the signs that my laptop was giving out on me was that on the last day of recording, all the footage corrupted. But at least I still had the stream playback, so let's just see the rest of the trophy. Go to class, uh, no, not class. We'll go to weapons. We'll go all the way down to advanced combat weapon. We press X. Boom, imposing arsenal. Open and buy final versions of all weapons. Eee! One of the last trophies I needed was the Madman trophy, where you need to complete a hundred levels. I played through the story mode three different times and I've grinded levels for days. And on this day in particular, I spent six hours grinding the same level over and over again before the trophy finally popped. Let's go! Oh, fuck you! The very last trophy was to buy all the perks for all the classes, and once I finally had enough money, I was ecstatic to finish the game. Handyman! Open and buy all perks in the game. Came back haunted, bitches! Ah. Oh, earn all other trophies in this fucking. This such a bad game. <laughs> such a bad game. After playing World War Z for 70 plus hours and losing a laptop over it, I can honestly say the first 30 hours of the game was fun. But when it got to the grind, the game became repetitive very quick. If I didn't have Mr. Mo, Goonie, and Al along my side to get the Platinum, I don't know how I would have made it this far. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And all I gotta say is, Jags Platinums is back, baby!